If you're looking for a cheap and instant place to buy your ultimate team coins, check out playerhot.com. Use the code NIFTY for a discount. How's it going guys, the Nifty Gamer here back again and today I'm going to be showing you a really cheap 20k starter team for FIFA 16. Now I've had many comments on my video saying to do a cheap squad builder, to do more squad builders, so I'm going to bring you guys squad builders. So this squad is really really solid, it's got really good defence, really good goalkeeper, really good midfield and a really good attack. Now, I have only played three games with this team, but I've won all of the games. I've won all three games really easily. Now, what I do recommend, guys, is here you can see I've done a bronze bench. This will make you come up across, like, worse opponents than you normally would. So now I've got that out of the way. This guy did actually cost 400 coins. He's got very, very good stats, 78 diving, 73 handling, and 81 reflexes. With 72 positioning, 6 foot 3, and acrobatic, he looks amazing. Next up then at right back we've got this guy for 600 coins, he looks very very good, medium high work rate, 6 foot 1 and he's very pacey considering his height, he's got 76 pace, 70 dribbling, 77 defending and 77 physical, very very solid fullback. Next up then our first centre back then is Umtiti, now we actually had a team of the season last year, he is a very very good player, he does have high high work rates which is a letdown, I might actually have to try him in CDM position. He does cost a bit, he costs 2.7k, I reckon in the next few weeks he will drop down to about k, so don't you worry about that there. He's got very very good stats, 74 pace, amazing, 70 dribbling, amazing, 80 defending, really good, and 79 physical which is amazing as well. Our next centre back then is a really good card as well, it's Kerbrat, I think that's how you say it, 71 pace, 66 dribbling, 78 defending, and 75 physical, he's got medium medium work rates, and he looks very very solid. Our left back then, as you can see, actually hasn't got any games played, now he did actually get a leg injury, and I'm not spending my coins on a leg healing card when it costs 1.5k I think, I'd rather just buy the player, considering he's cost 400 coins, I just discarded him and brought another one. He's a fairly decent fullback in my opinion, 73 pace, 76 dribbling, 76 defending, and 73 passing, he does do the job. Next up then one of the players in the centre mid position, he is in the wrong position which is why I've actually put a French manager in the team but this guy looks very very good, those are all round amazing stats, medium medium work rates which is brilliant, 80 pace, 75 dribbling, 70 defending, 79 physical and 70 passing which is amazing. Next up we've got Coquelin who is one of the best CDMs I've actually used, he gets man in a match every single game, all the games I've played with him so far this year he's been man in a match, he is an amazing player on this game, I'm not just saying that because I'm an Arsenal fan, literally I'm not saying that because I'm an Arsenal fan, he has got man in a match all the time. His defending is on point, his slide tackles are amazing, his standing tackles are amazing, he's the perfect CDM. Our next CM then is Fajar, I really don't know how to say that, I'm not French, but this guy looks pretty good as well. He's actually got two assists in three games, which really is not too bad when you think about it. 70 pace, 77 dribbling, 63 physical and 77 passing. Our cam then is actually Wijnaldum, who has actually gone in price because he scored today. He has got 82 pace, 84 dribbling, 75 shooting, 73 passing and 70 physical. He is absolutely amazing. Two goals in three games for me is amazing in my opinion. Our first of our strikers then is Origi. He's 6 foot 1, very tall indeed for a striker. And also he's got very good pace considering his height. He's got 85 pace, 76 dribbling, 74 shooting, 68 passing and 64 physical. He also has 4 star skill moves guys. It is amazing. This card is insane which is probably why it costs a bit. It costs near on 3k. And our last striker then, another amazing player which is why he costs quite a bit. Another 3k player but this guy, oh my god, he finishes pretty much everything. Now I have actually took quite a lot of shots with these players because I'm ans I am still getting used to the game but pretty much every shot you need to take with him that you should score pretty much goes in. So I'm going to keep this team as a fitness team, build another team and hopefully the other team I build will be good enough to do a squad builder around. So I do hope you guys have enjoyed, if you have smashed the like button, make sure to buy this team, cost about 20k, cheap as chips really, considering you can just play the foot draft, get that 20k, build this team, easy enough. I do hope you've enjoyed. Smash the like button if you have. Leave a comment down below. And until next time, guys, peace. Why can't I realize I'm fighting for my life? Whoa. Why 
I can't I realize I'm fighting for my life. Whoa, 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 whoa. 